and a good Saturday afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the championship round of the 2017 Life Storage Mac Baseball Championships. Alongside Eddie Acapinti, my name is Todd Callen, and we have indeed reached the championship round. It'll be the Marist College Red Foxes, the number two seed, emerging from the winner's bracket, taking on the fourth-seeded Iona Gales. Iona is on a run as they have made it out of the loser's bracket. He's in a deep hole now, 0-2. Pitch on the way, swing and a miss. He struck him out. Outfield medium depth. 2-0 pitch, swung on. This is drilled out to left. Back goes to Mayo. He's at the wall, and it's gone. A solo home run off the bat of Andrew Rouse, his third home run of the season, and the Red Foxes jump in front, 1-0. Well, Andrew Rouse says... Pitch on the way, swung on line, over the outstretched glove of the second baseman, Breen. It'll be a base hit, scoring is Kapazinski. They'll cut the throw as Ian Tosca moves up 90 feet to third base, 2-0 lead. Here it comes, swing and a miss. Late break, the throw down is cut off. Now they'll try and score the runner from third, and he's in on a head first slide. Trying to move up 90 feet, the tag at third, not in time. Ian Tosca scored on the throw down to second. And even 200. That'll drop a little as Bochus gets his third strikeout, one away, in the third. And it comes back. The 1-0 is laced into the outfield. Waving and coming around to score is Kapasinski. In safely at second base is Pagano. Third play in their arsenal. This time they let Kirkpatrick swing, and he lifts one to left. DeMeo has to retreat. He'll make the catch. It should be deep enough to score Pagano. Tagging from second is Leitner. More execution from the Red Foxes as the fourth. A great start for Marist. And he gets Levecki. Big swing from Hoagland again, and Bochus has it going. Bruno leads from first. Served out into left field, a fair ball. Bruno. Will round third being waved around. He'll score. It's an RBI double for Joe DeMeo. First pitch to Kinsey's caught by Tavares. He climbs the ladder and comes away with 2 2 pitch. Swing and a miss. And trying to extend the game. Here it comes. Swing and a miss. He struck him out. Romanelli comes in, gets his third save of the series, and the Red Foxes have won it. Todd, thank you very much. I'm here with, believe it or not, he's not thrilled. I'm sure happy about a championship. But, Scott, what a great start that you were able to put forth in this deciding game, a lot on the line. What was going through your mind out there when you were just going through batters left and right? I mean, can't really say anything but thank my team behind me. I have the confidence in them to throw any pitch that I want. And without them, I wouldn't be the pitcher that I am, so I owe it all to them. I can hear him cheering behind me. What does it mean to you and this group to get Marist its first championship since 2009? The seniors on this team really worked hard over the past four years. We had our struggles and everything, but this is just this is surreal. We worked so hard for this in the fall. September, we all talked about dogpiling for the championship, and we're here, and we worked really hard for it. So. Well, it was a great tournament and a better dog pile. It's a professional out there. Go join your teammates. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. That's Scott Boach just with a tremendous start and, and a guy I've been able to now speak to three times this weekend. And, Coach, congratulations on what was a thoroughly impressive performance for your Red Foxes in this tournament. Yeah. You're, you're emotional right now with good reason. What does this mean to you? Uh, it means a lot. I mean, obviously, having played here and experienced it. Yeah! <laughs> I've never had that happen during an interview. Um, so anyway, <laughs> no, and, and to go back on, I mean, you know, I've been associated with Maris for probably, you know, close to 16 years now. Um, and a lot of guys before me that we played with, the text, the calls, you know, all knew that this team was something special. And in September, we knew it too. And we just had to keep fighting and guys stay focused on these guys. I couldn't be more proud of them. They deserve everything they get. Well, Coach, it's a tr true testament to you and what your staff does. And, and now to represent this league moving forward, I know you said you're a Marist guy through and through. I know it means a lot to you. I saw you run up in the stands. Family here, too. This is a big moment for you. Congratulations. No, thanks. It's uh, it's pretty cool. I wish my wife and kids were uh, were here, there at home. And uh, 
and I'll get home some point in the morning, probably wake them up and we'll spend some time together. But, uh, you know, they make the true sacrifice along with our parents, um, my parents, the kids' parents, and, and, and do a lot, and, and I know that they'll all enjoy this. Well, Coach, it's a real deserved honor. Congratulations on a championship. Appreciate it. That's Mayor's head coach, Chris Traz, a wet Chris Traz, going to celebrate this championship with his team. It was a tremendous effort. Todd, pleasure working with you and the whole crew. I'll kick it back to you to say goodbye from Sal Magley Stadium.